If you're looking to expand your influence and connections on LinkedIn, I wanna share with you some of the quickest and easiest ways to do that. So to put this in perspective, once again, I'm gonna look at this big picture of all the things you can do to advance your career development strategy. And here on LinkedIn, we're gonna focus here today on creating connections, which is so critical to how you can connect and expand your network. So some of the easiest ways to do this is to utilize the tools that LinkedIn gives you to do that. So go into your network tab, to look at what your network looks like right now, one of the quickest ways you can do this is to actually connect any email addresses that you have and it'll scan the address books in your email addresses, compare those emails against people that exist on LinkedIn and give you suggestions of people to connect with. So great, so quick, so easy, because these are people that you already know, you've already interacted with or corresponded with to some degree and so it's, maybe a way to rekindle some of those old relationships and business relationships and school relationships, whatever that is, so that you can do this effectively. You can do this with multiple email addresses, so put them all in and see what LinkedIn shows you, right? You can also ask like, who do you know? LinkedIn is always trying to give you suggestions of people that might be good for you to know, whether that's alumni or people that have worked in the same places as you or other places, consider, who do you know? Just click on that network button and see if there's any suggestions that LinkedIn gives that are helpful. You can also connect with people using LinkedIn even in in-person situations. So LinkedIn has a feature that you can scan and show a QR code to be able to quickly and easily connect with people on LinkedIn. I've done this at meetings and networking events and all sorts of things. It can be quite useful to do this effectively. Maybe even better in, for some of you than a business card. Finally, there's all sorts of other things. You can look at who are the secondary connections. Maybe you can get introductions. Um, you can look at the data about who's viewing your profile. If you're creating content on LinkedIn, who is liking and commenting and engaging on your content, thanking them, trying to reach out and share a connection with them, right? So all sorts of things that don't take too much time and effort, but can quickly and easily and meaningfully expand your network and the people that you're having conversations with and connecting with that you never know which of those contacts and opportunities and conversations could be the difference in you having a great opportunity that you're looking for. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Jeff Perry. I'm a leadership and career development expert and I would love to help you optimize your approach to your career development strategy. Please reach out and let's connect soon. Thanks so much for watching. Mm -hmm.